Hi and welcome back to Cut the Craggle. Today we're going to be taking a look at this. Issue 33 of the LEGO City magazine. This was sent to me for free to review from Immediate Media, so a massive thank you to them. But as always, all opinions in this video will be my own. Alright, let's peel back the cover and check this thing out. After cracking a case with private detective Pete Python last time, the star of this issue is none other than Duke Detain himself. The comic, playfully titled Fly Hard, opens on criminal mastermind R.E. Fenrich. For some reason, the evil billionaire tasks his gang of crooks to steal Mary Sinclair's bacon ingredients. Diabolical. At the LEGO City Airport, the Sinister Stooges move into position, disguised as various workers, ready to intercept the bacon ingredients when they arrive by plane. But unbeknownst to them, the ace cop, Duke Detain, is also arriving at the airport, playing taxi for his captain. And it's not long before his police intuition detects something is amiss. This was another fun adventure in LEGO City, and whilst the bad guy's motives made only a little more sense than last time, I felt the story flowed a lot better. It was a bit strange that this was the second issue in a row that was set at an airport and had a finale where our hero has to stop a plane taking off. But for the most part, I enjoyed the playful rift on Die Hard 2. Hey, wait. I know that old lady. I zapped him. I tried it on my little dog. Poor thing limped for a week. There was even a one-panel homage to The Matrix. Up until now, I've been increasingly impressed with the artwork in these various LEGO mags, but I felt they took a step backwards in the most recent LEGO Star Wars mag. Here, I'm pleased to say the art is back on top form. Just look at this amazing double-page action panel. Like the last issue of LEGO City, the puzzles and activities are woven into the story of the comic. So when Duke needs to find a suspect in a crowd, you have a double spread Where's Wally style picture puzzle. And when he pursues a crook down a baggage carousel, you need to help him navigate the chaotic maze of conveyor belts. The free minifig with this issue is, of course, Duke Detain. And he comes with a couple of accessories, a set of handcuffs, and a light paddle, I guess? This is the same print that comes in a bunch of the LEGO City sets, but it's still a great looking minifigure. Really like that crisp torso print, which also has some back printing. And of course, he comes with an alternate face print, wearing his snazzy shades. I think he probably wears those most of the time to take the focus off those eyebrows. He also comes with this little roadblock build, and this even appears in the comic which I thought was pretty funny. It's a very simple assembly, with a couple of nice parts, but nothing to write home about. In a rather nice surprise though, this issue actually had an extra free minifigure. For me, it was this LEGO City firefighter who comes with this little barrel assembly, I guess. And the idea, I think, is that you knock the fire off the top like that. Because, as everyone knows, the only way to put out a fire is to tip it over. Issue 34 of the LEGO City magazine will be in stores from December 9th and will come with a free Deep Sea Diver minifigure. Let me know what you think of issue 33 of the LEGO City magazine in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video, and if you haven't already, be a hero and hit that subscribe button. I'll see you next time. Laters!